This is 39 hours spanning over three days in the first week of June and split into six episodes. Four teams spread across North America are competing to catch the biggest fish of as many different species as they can. Team Manitoba is Aaron Weeb and Jay Siemens. Team Dakota Lithium is Adam Conrad and Sean Conrad. It's go time! Team Tackle Box Lottery is Paul Castellano and Taro Murata. we got three days of this, man. Team Acme Kalins is Eric Hadia and Alex Perrick. One point is available yes, for yes, the yes, longest yes, legal yes. fish of any species over 10 inches. Live updates must be submitted to the live target leaderboard, and the team with the most points at the end of the 39 hours will be awarded $10,000 to donate to a charity of their choice, courtesy of Alumacraft Boats. This is 39 Hours Season 2, presented by Aquaview. Team Manitoba, Team Kalins, and Acme, do you know where your partner is? Because I don't know where my partner is. Sometimes traditions are important. It helps maintain your heritage. And I feel like this, the entrance of my partner, the one, the only, will be very entertaining for everybody, at my expense. And he says, oh, it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. Let me tell you something. See what's going on right now? You see that light? Salmon, the only time that they're really dumb, I find around here, for me anyway, right at daybreak, right at dawn. So hopefully he shows up soon. Day one. We are 15 minutes from sunrise, which means the start of period one. I'm Aaron Weed, there's Jay Siemens. What's going on? We are Team Manitoba, and we are about to get started on some roadside moon eye. This is our home away from home for the last five hours. Barrier Bay Resort, enough time for steaks, coffee. We're gonna shoot a couple hoops. It's five in the morning. Kobe, we're about to drain a three. Yep. <laughs> Make it rain and we're gone. Oh! <laughs> Oh. No way! This is just a sign of how easy the fish is going to be today. <laughs> I thought you were going to alley-oop it. Okay, let's do it again. This takes teamwork. You ready? Oh! Let's go, let's go! Did you dunk? Yeah, <laughs> kind of. Tick tock. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Kid's unbelievable. Don't get me wrong, he's hilarious. We'll drive crazy. Lines go down in, uh, I think, six minutes. We're about 25, 26 minutes away from the spot once we launch. Lines in in 15 minutes. Let's go. My partner won't get out of bed this morning. I shouldn't have been paired with an old guy. Like, I can't deal with this guy. He's like 80. You ready, brother? So slow. I think we need to get the Star Spangled Banner playing for us. Yeah, I think so too. How does that work? It goes like this. Oh, say can you see? The goal for today, one rock bass landed. Keep your goals and expectations low. Seven minutes. Oh, sh three minutes. We're going to be late. We could have got five extra minutes of fishing time probably if we were up and at the spot right now. Like, imagine we were sitting there waiting anticipation. Stressing out right now. This is supposed to be fun. Conrad Brothers? They're on the spot waiting. I'm probably, yeah. They've been on the spot for the past half hour. They have 412 minnows, and they're going through every one right now, grabbing the biggest, most lively one, just having them ready to rock. Dropping cameras down, probably. Oh. Identifying lines which in, fish they're gonna in, lines No, in. no! Lines in. Here we are, Adam. Freaking awesome out here. Team Dakota Lithium, and we are gonna be winning this 39 hour series. We're sitting on a spot with possible 60 pound lake trout. <laughs> so we're gonna try and hook one quick so we can get out of here and go over some monster pike. We found a nice hump out here in the main lake that shoots up to 15 feet. Yesterday I got my 42 inch on this Lucky Strike spoon. So I'm gonna be trolling that. Yeah. And I'm just trolling a T60 flatfish and we just have inline two ounce weights. What's, what's on the back of that, Sean? That is a hoochie for extra tail, more color. It gives them something to strike at. This lake trout point is a very critical point. The Far East teams have the Great Lakes and they are gonna be dialed on their lake trout spots. And when we check in with a 40, 40 plus, plus incher lake trout, they are going to just be Decimated. Decimated. Why should we even try for lake trout now? We're behind schedule. The sun is already above the tree line. The goal is to try to catch three species here. Lake trout, sheephead, and carp. 
Anything else is a bonus, maybe bullhead, but we couldn't find bullhead yesterday, so. Lake Ontario Junkfish Box. Let's see what's inside. These are gonna be a big gig. He's been smashing on this. He's deadly with anything breathy, floaty, drifty. Hey, Paul? He's current, but he's classic. Kalins, street minnow. Great for ripping. Sheephead love ripping. Jointed, live target. Oh my. Everything eats a smell over here. Greasy bait, greasy fish. Jig heads, rattle inside. Murky water, fish can hear it. Wow, unbelievable. Thank you. TacoBoxLottery.com. Everybody should get some. Check it out. Ooh, look at that nice sunrise. Okay, I'm gonna say grace. Okay. Dear God, thank you for this beautiful day that you've created. We just wanna pause and remember that there's so much more to this world than uh, today in this competition, but we do want to pray for uh, calm minds and wisdom as we challenge uh, these close friends of ours, and we wanna pray for safety for everybody else involved and steady hands for Nick on the camera as we um, take this on and move out of it with friendships and life lessons that are far more valuable than the win that you have already likely given us. And amen. There we go. This is it. This year is a little bit different. Instead of the update every six hours, we're doing live updates on the live target scoreboard and we will find out as soon as the fish is caught. Assuming the person has reception. Yeah. And if they don't have reception, then they can't be getting updates. They can't be giving updates. So it's not like an advantage or a disadvantage. They are going to be checking in continuously. So we're going to get about a hundred texts when we go back to camp. Tackle Box Lottery has had light for an hour already. So we could be getting fish updates from them at any point if they're actually up in time. With Taro, I feel like it's kind of 50-50. We lost about an hour. We had a slow start. We just set up out in the exact same wave points. Yesterday, we were seeing like hook, 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 right on the bottom. You ready, partner? Line's in, line's in. Let's go, let's go. It's go time. It's go time. Oh man, dropping down on monsters. Come on. First bite, be a big one. So we're on 40 feet here, right at the start of where we're marking fish. It's like there's a little hill first. It goes up to about 35 here, and then it drops back down, I think. And then it comes up to 15. There's a fish. Okay, good. Neutral. It's not, I don't know how big it is. Okay, you, you gonna just, worry about that? Yeah, I'll worry about it. I'm not it. even gonna measure that fish. No. It's a pike. No, no. it's a lake trout. Oh, lake trout. Little gaffer. What are you doing eating a spoon half your size? Chill. Oh, they're gluttonous. Oh man, there, off, good. One minute in, we've hooked a fish. Three minutes to spare, let's go, let's go, let's go. Check both ways where we cross the road, please, folks. Right down here or no? I think down here somewhere. <laughs> Do you like this? This could not be any more perfectly timed. Is your alarm gonna be audible, Nick? It's on, it's on. Let's now, go, now. go time. Oh, I like that. Little hook and a worm, sliding bobber, so I can set the depth to as deep as I want. It is five in the morning, most people are. Oh my goodness, I got a smallie, Jay. What? I lost him. I lost him. It was a smallie. <laughs> he was like right against the bank. Like right in here. Just looking for that one bobber down. Hook set, net, measure, celebrate, get out of here. Jay wants to have that smallie point. Here we go, got him. Come on. Smallie. Unreal. We've got the smallie point. <laughs> and look at this, smallmouth. First thing in the morning on a slip bobber here on our moon eye spot. This is how we are measuring our fish on the custom Fat Boy Muskie Bumper Bump Board. Nearest quarter inch rounding down. The mouth closed, tail pinched, 17 and a half inches. First on the live target leaderboard with a 17 and a half inch smallmouth. <laughs> Job, buddy. They're mm -hmm. not expecting us to smallie fish. Put some pressure on them. Oh yeah, there's suspended fish here, look. Oh yeah. Some good ones too, they look like bass right here. Fish. Got him? Yep. Big? Yep. Nut? Yeah. Come on, be a walleye, be a walleye. Pike. Oh. Damn. Okay, okay. Not what we're after, first species though. We'll take it. Team USA is on the board with fish number one, and it is a northern pike. 31 three quarters. Let's go. We're leading. We're leading in pipe. Yeah. Leaderboard 31 and three quarter inch northern pike. No way. That's bigger than the pike that won last year. You would not have expected that. You'd expect Team Acme Kalins. 
to be on smallmouth and you yes. expect team manitoba to, to be, be on, on pike. pike hey if they catch a big pike we're not going for them this is good i like that there's updates of the fish constantly i like that fish 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 get him buddy gone really yeah come on gone, man. okay that's cool we got bit though you got to check the dipsy and make sure everything's groovy dangle dangle got it. oh, it's coming got incoming it. Fish. fish 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 Got him? Oh, Let me take it. Oh, you want him? Take, take it. Take it. Take it. I'll run the boat. Just yeah. let me ride. Got it? Yeah. My arm's going to fall off. Uh oh. This is a good one, Paul. I know. I saw that when it was shaking. It felt big, eh? Yeah. Good. Get it over with. What it if is. it's a giant? Do we just get out we're of done. here? If it's the right one, we're, we're done. Out. We're done. But we got to try for salmon for a little bit. Okay. It's the time. It's the time yeah. of day. Yeah. All right. What can you do different for that salmon? We'll get two spoons, two body baits going, and pump up the speed faster. This you know? is big, buddy. Good. This is Just a Just make giant. sure it can slip. Make sure it can slip. My arm is killing me. Hurts, eh? You want me to take a round? I'm going to go yeah. for a few? Go for a few. Okay. <laughs> My arm's full of blood. I don't think it's that big. Okay, you go again. Okay, take over. Go, take over. I need a break, too. <laughs> this is a marathon, not a sprint. <laughs> we got three days of this, man. These things are too big. Keep going. Ugh. It's fat, but it's not a fat competition. Oh, it's a length. length. Whoa. Woo! Woo! Let's get a measurement quick. 31 and three quarters. We caught smaller yesterday, but longer. There she goes. Got to get it back. It's got some blood coming out. Boom. Boom. Woo! Fish number one. You want to go? Yep. We're moving. Next stop, dinosaur fishing. Go, 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 go. We are bait fishing for sturgeon, the number one tactic. Two ounce weight, probably more than we need because there's not much current here. Swivel, this is like tip up line, some Dacron, barbless octopus hook. Worms is gonna be the bait of choice. Hopefully one of those big sucker mouths will. Mm! Oh, I just got bit again. I'd say come right up in here and hit spot lock. Those fish are right up along the wall. Hey, I got one going on here. I think so, hold on. There he is. Oh. Big smolly. Big smolly? Yep. Want to flip him or you want to not him? No, he ain't that big. I'll just flip him. I don't know. We'll bump him just to make sure. But I'm thinking he's going to be close to that. Uh-oh, boys. Mouth closed. 18 and a quarter inch. What do you want us to tell Aaron? Aaron, this fish right here is what I would call a fine representative Team USA. Let's go, baby, in the lead. It's <laughs> a good start right there. Okay, it's back down to 43, but behind the boat it's 25. And we're coming up to that 15 foot hump where we hooked that big one. So we're just gonna go right over top of it. Come on. What's going on? 15 feet, I just hit bottom is all at him. Oh. Don't worry. Here's one. Monster. You got a fish yeah. on? Yep, yep, I'm good, yep. I'm good. Big fish, big fish. Here we go. Put it in reverse. You sure? Keep that tension, I don't want, Sean. I like the tension to stay okay. on him, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, good. Big fish. He's going way to the left. He is pissed. Back right up. Yeah, it's okay. Oh, boys. Can this be our fish right away? Oh, it's like I'm on bottom. Nice, that's oh, what man. we want. I just want to get away from that motor. Yeah, we're good. It's a neutral oh, shot. Oh, man. This is heavy. Good, Sean. This it's is what like we I want. want an anchor. Oh, yeah. Look at this. That a boy. Oh, my arm is burning. I love it. Oh, man. You see this? Yeah. Oh, yeah. 39 hours. <sighs> Season two. Here we go. We are in giant territory. Oh, man. Oh, man. Yeah. That's yeah, a 40 yeah. inch. Yeah, it's 40 inch. That's freaking huge. Got him. Oh, oh man. There's one. Freaking giant! Hey, you handle the fish? Giant! The pliers. I got this uh, measuring board ready. I'm coming to the front here. Oh. Hooks out. Hooks oh, out. man. Oh, man. We're going to get a quick leg. You need a measurement here? Okay. You got the head there? You 40, got the head look, two look, look, look. 42. Look you got 42, 42 inches. Inch. Whoa. Yeah. Team Dakota Lithium. 42 inch lake trout. Oh, man. No, it's going back. 42-inch lake trout. Oh, man. Here he goes. 
42 inches, Sean. He's gone. 42! 42! 42. <laughs> Giant! Okay, Adam. Yeah. Let me tell you how nice that bite felt. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I felt good for you, bro. Oh, man. Daryl, good start. Good start. You never know. 31 and three quarters. You never know. It's like a chicken box lottery. You could get KFC. You could. You could get Mary Brown's. That's right. Or you could get Swiss Chalet and win the lottery. <laughs> One of my best things with Auto Line Hunter is three quarters full, straight down the pipe with a certain lure. Oh, fish, Paul. Fish, Paul. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Should I reel this one in? Oh, I would so we don't tangle. Fishes interrupt us. <laughs> pump and dump. Do you like pumping or do you like dumping? Depends. Sometimes you need a pump and sometimes you need a dump. This is too easy to move. And sometimes you need pumping and dumping. Too easy to move. I'm talking about serious things here. We're gonna take over. Oh, my wingman. Ultimate teamwork here. You can dump in the front live well while I'm pumping. So we're out here we're in 102 feet of water and we got a whole bunch of lake trout that we found yesterday and they're still here. The challenge is can we get a big one? Gonna wean through them for a couple hours and then we gotta make a decision when it's time to go and try to sight fish a, a big carp, maybe a big sheephead. Okay. Oh, Cowbells! Up. Moo plus a boo on the cowbellarella. Oh! Here you go. Oh wow. Greasy. Too small. Ho 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 ho. In. Are we doing only high fives and handshakes? Maybe just belly bumps? Oh, there's a bite. There's a bite, hundred percent. Talk to me. I felt small and peckish. What the? That was like loose. I wonder what happened there. Oh, what? What? We're on the board. <laughs> Look at the size of that hook versus the size of that perch. That's not going to make the 10 inch minimum, but I can still feel the bites. Makes me feel very confident. I will feel a little sturgeon sucking on it. All right, so I'm just re rigging back up the new little tickle tails here. They're just paddle tails and grubs. That's the deal right there. Cast it out, pop it, reel it back in. I'm just rigging that up on a football head jig. We're really hoping for a big walleye, but when you fish along these pier heads, you never know what you can catch. Big pike, big musky, big, yes, yes. Big smallest. Oh, he spit it. Dude, that was a hog. That was like a five pounder. Yeah, that was a hog. How the heck did he spit that thing? Oh, well. Should we just go musky fish? Let's give this five more minutes. Okay, okay, okay. In the boat, what is this? Rock bass. Oh. Not big enough. Not big enough. We just need, we need one 10 inch rock bass right here. That'd be a bonus. Yeah, it would be. We just secured our lake trout point and we are going to just fish a little bit longer. This is fun fishing now. Adam, 42 we, inch laker. Yeah. <laughs> when it when it matters. I know. When it matters. Okay, buddy. Let's put one. Oh, fish, 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 fish. Oh no. Look, we both put it out uh, and they bring me back in. And they're biting the mafia finger once again. <laughs> oh no. Hey, that was perfect. Oh, what no. movie is that from? Donnie uh, Brasco? Alright. Oh, fish, 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 oh, fish, no. fish, 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 fish. But yeah. Fish. No, but is he still yeah. there? Wait, is he still there? Yeah, yeah. man. <laughs> oh no. Double. <laughs> Double oh. grease! <laughs> grease freak! <laughs> Greek freak! Oh. Yours is bending more. This is like Team Dakota lithium size that they catch. I feel like we have an advantage over them psychologically because you're a father of twins, little Laker. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the father of you twins. Know? Can you believe I'm a dad? Yeah. That's insane, bro. They shouldn't have let this happen. Keep going, keep going. It's a heavy bugger. See what I mean? I knew it. Oh my gosh, it's, it's a big fish. Short and fat, but oh man. Wow, it's so fat. No, it's the same, just under 31. Boom, 31, 31, 31 and a quarter. What 30, a fish. Oh, he's bleeding a bit, so let's just get him back. Awesome. Still super nice, so fat, so healthy. I think as soon as we get a sturgeon, we're gonna be out of here. We gotta try for moon eye for even 20 minutes, it feels like. Doesn't it, or is that just terrible? Oh, 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 oh. Definitely. I think I'm gonna hit him. Really? You ready? Yeah. Yep. Wow. We're on. We're on. Freaking rights. I think it's a sturgeon. It's got some weight. Ooh. Tournaments just make everything so much more nerve wracking. 
Those bites were light. I don't think this is a huge sturgeon, but. Talk to me on time. We just need anything. It's, it's gonna be here pretty quick, I think. Not big, but it is the right species. Come on. Nice. Good. Got him. Good job, buddy. Target species acquired. There you have a beautiful Manitoba sturgeon. First of the morning. All right. Nose touching. Longest tip of the tail. We got 38 and a quarter. Beautiful little sturgeon. They get a lot bigger, but I am just happy that we have one because these are not easy fish to catch. Going back. Charged up. Oh, here we go. One more cast. You gotta get a muskie, it's more important than the walleye. You know, we spent our time here, got a couple fish. Yeah, I missed a big small. You missed a big one. Yeah. Yeah, yours is 20 inches. Yeah. Go up around the corner, have myself fun all summer long now. Don't need those heavy electronics and them gadgets. Just go up here to McGovern's Point, anchor up there all summer long, 12 feet of water, drop down a crawler. I'm telling you what, son. You're gonna have non-stop action. You guys waste your time here now, fishing for them, whatever, them walleyes. Fish is a fish now. They all taste the same. Small mouth, large mouth, no mouth, whatever. You know, they're all good to eat. Carp. 16, still 15, 16, so we'll just keep going up, back and forth on that hump. I think I'm getting hit here. Smacked me twice, dropping it back. There he is! Oh, he hit it again. Dropping it back, come on. There's one. You got one? Yeah, let's keep going though. Okay. Small. Small. Oh yeah, jumps. Just a little tiny one. They're hitting a spoon half their size. I haven't been able to hook a giant in 20 minutes. This is embarrassing. <laughs> you are fishing with the world record holder. Yeah. You're welcome. This is what I gotta deal with all the time. <laughs> Feel my pain. Adam and I don't fish these northern like way northern lakes, like the flying ones. We've never actually, this is our first time. We literally found a spot in the middle of nowhere and we tried and we're trolling along for about 45 minutes and then it comes right up to a big hump that we found. And we hooked a, that 40 incher yesterday. So here we are again and we smacked a 42. It's good, we did it perfect. We got a good big fish. We left without affecting yeah. the area too much. We're gonna go get a pike point here. Try for a monster pike. Yeah, buddy. Woo. You're welcome, Adam. You're welcome. <laughs> mafia finger's been on fire. Oh, fish. Fuck, mafia finger. Speak of the mafia finger. Here we go again. Same old mafia finger, just another day. Oh, it's a good one. It's a big one. But is it 35, 34? It might I don't be. Think it's, long, so. it's longer. It's longer. I don't know. It's long. Beans, it doesn't matter. This I thing. can't see. Tell me what to do. I got it. Oh. No. Wah, wah, wah. Same year class, 31. Boo. Fish. Fish. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Again, this one's yours. I can't. Oh, no. I can't. It's too many. More lake trout, more problems. Polly Castellano Signature Series Mafia Fingers. Woo! Available here. Taco Box Lottery, if you're listening, you got to put it in Polly Castellano's Signature Series. It looks like crap, but it works like crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, watch the bells. Rock the bells. Oh, they're so greasy and slimy and slippery. Oh, oh Terry, you stepped on the trouble. Oh, <laughs> you're such a klutz, man. What a nice guy. Did you hear that? That's how he is in real life. Everybody, for the viewers, I'm just a nice guy. I'm a nice fish, though. That's right. <laughs> He's angry. He's no, blowing I'm not, off. I'm not annoyed. No, He's I'm going off the no, slope. No, there's a difference. This is like day you one. You know what it is, Terry? It's Terrell? like the second hour, and he's already falling off the slope. No, you know what the problem viewers. is? I'll tell you the problem. Drama! <laughs> Drama! Oh, it's so funny! It's so funny! I'm not Drama. like that. Don't try to cover up the real you. What's that supposed to mean? You're exposing the real you. You saw so Steph. I work with people so every day of my down. life. We're breaking them down. Terrell is an form. only child. The raw and form. insecurity is something that he has a hard time dealing with. Hence, breaking you down, we're gonna build you back up. Moving spots, we're gonna attempt to try to catch the hardest freshwater fish by man, and that is the muscalunge. AP's got a little spot up here. He calls the Canucks Corner, where he guarantees they go old muskies, so that's why we're pulling up here. Definitely don't guarantee a muskie. What are you gonna throw? I think I might throw this blade. I like that. It's currently 7, 11 in the morning. 
We've been fishing for two hours. We're grinding, we're trying to catch a muskie right now. I'm just making myself a little chicken breast seasoned with stone ground mustard, sharp cheddar cheese on there. Mmm. Maybe we can stop and- Stop touching me. Cast the floats stop out a couple me. times stop at it. the Rennie. You wanna try the Rennie River a little bit? No, stop. Ow! Okay, let's go. I'm kind of getting bored. I feel like he gets so uptight and high strung and he's a control freak. So everything's gotta be perfect, which makes him a good angler. But sometimes his mind goes out the window when it's not exactly his way. He doesn't like my hippie ways, you know what I mean? He's more of like a corporate general that wants to dominate the world and sell gas at a high price and rip everyone off. Really? Oh. Did you just say that? <laughs> Is that really a description of me? That's why I know Taro's upset. It's not about the competition anymore. Do you want a hug? No, I already, 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 I already I just said sorry. explained it. Where I does it come sorry. from is what we got to find out during this 39 hours. You know what it's like? It's like a volcano. Where does it really you know? come from? Maybe a zit will work. You know the what zit? is this really the about? The zit grows and it grows and it grows. And then you have to release the zit. And then, and then it goes back to normal. You ready? Yeah. Take one more cast here. We got to get that sucker point too. I mean, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's the only shot really. Yeah, yeah, you're right. I mean, let's just go and get some points. and. Even though we have the smallmouth point right now, there is no way we're gonna keep that. No way. No way. It is not possible. We need to go upgrade that point to a 20 plus. Oh no, we got a tax. Oh, it's Terrell's wife. Is it really? <laughs> yeah. And I, then he goes. I love it. Fighting with Paul already. Good for film though. We need to get into some fights. No, fighting's not good. I'm a former Marine, and if I fight, I fight to kill. Oh. I go for the eyes. And I go for the balls. They teach you how to really inhumanely hurt someone. But I think there's a fine line between disrespect and bickering. That's all, I wasn't trying to be disrespectful. Was it the little needling of me no, all the okay. time? No, it's okay. I didn't mean to, bad choice of uh, tone. Because <laughs> no. I know in Japanese culture, tone means so Difference. much. I'm sorry. I am sorry. I'm sorry too. We're good again. We're good. I feel like we're like real brothers. Like we're honestly, good. like really. We fight and we make him up. Him and I are like real siblings. We fight and we make up. So much love. So much it's hate. So much frustra <laughs> frustration. It's not hate. It's Fru frustration. Frustrado. Don't worry, Paul. The people will love you, but they'll also hate you. Yeah, I know. And that's the way they feel about me, and that's okay. It's a thin line between love and hate. Do, do, do. But we want a very thin, long line, not a thick line. Length in 39 hours is key. Uh oh, we are under attack. I'll reduce my speed. Officer Paul got yelled at by the officer. Woo, woo. That's the sound of the police. Woo, woo. That's the sound of the beast. Watch out, Paul, slow down. Cops everywhere. Where's my box? Team Kalen, look out. You should never put this in Paul Castellano's hands. Yesterday we came in here with this little jig and he plucked off individual giants and it's about to go down right now. One of these, like we said before, smelty. These straight sticks Big for ripping. Sheep, giant like ripping, ripping with Ooh. this. Look, he's on it. Anyway, back to business. There's a giant right there. Man, how do I get in front of that one with this light jig, my fly rod? Got him! Big one! Nat! That was sick. Pitched that little jig over, came off the rock, it dropped big? it, just like bass, exactly yeah. like bass. They're here. His mouth flared. He moved forward. Oh, this forward. is big, buddy. This is bigger than yesterday. This is huge. This is huge. This is a point. Bye-bye. Holy cow! This might be the biggest carp I've ever seen if we land it. Like, this is, I'm this like, is insane. I don't normally get nervous with carp. Oh I'm actually God. nervous, nervous I'm right nervous. now. The thing is huge. My armpits are sweating. I have sweaty armpits right now. Hold on. Oh. Go, go, go. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh my gosh, you see the size of this thing? Oh my gosh. This might be like a record carp, bro. I'm not even kidding. I know. This is like, I'm not even kidding. This could be like an Ontario record. Go, 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 go. You hit my line. Oh, yes! You got him. Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh my gosh. In the mouth. So massive, <sighs> bud. This is massive. Oh. This is bigger than yes. Look how oh thick it is. Oh my gosh. Is it longer though? Oh my gosh. Two minutes into the oh. spot. That's how it's done, bro. Woo! Woo! Oh, it's gonna measure it. Oh my gosh. That thing is massive, oh. boys. Make sure it's touching. Touching. 36 touching right there. That's a backbreaker, bro. My shoulder's <laughs> killing me from the lake trout. Now this is killing me. Woo! That's some big time grease, bro. <laughs> Unbelievable grease. Okay, let's let it go. Yeah. Let's let it go. Let's let it go. No one's oh. gonna beat that. No one's gonna beat that. Oh. Move on. That was a massive fish. Move on to the, you wow. know what we're moving we'll on to? We'll get the sheep. We'll get the sheep. Yep.
What time is it, Aaron? 8.23. No, it's Tulabi time. It is Tulabi time. We're going for the Cisco. Yeah, a lot of people ice fish for them. I've never really targeted them open water, so. And mud basin, chance at a nice perch, chance at some other species, maybe a walleye pike. Like 36 inch carp. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> that is a giant. What? <laughs> like a false face. <laughs> so we won't be fishing for carp? No carp. I don't think I've ever seen a 36 inch carp before. Oh my goodness. So now buffalo points, even more important. Buffalo and then drum, right? Let's go for suckers, drum, whitefish, white bass, white carp, every yellow belly, white belly species of fish we can catch off the bottom. Bullhead? Yep. So we're tied. And yeah, we're but first. Uh, Conrad brothers have no cell service. Yep. So they're going to come back with a list. Pike will probably be one of the first ones that comes off there. All right, let's go get that big fish you're talking about. Okay. There's two different ones. Big one right here. Oh, you saw him? Yeah, I see him right now. They're super tight to the bank. Oh, dude, like see, crazy. See him? Look, look, look. He's right here. It's a good one. It's a good one. Oh, that was a big one, too. What was it? 20 incher. Stay still, stay still, stay still. Oh, my gosh, no way. He ate it. He ate it. Heck yes, dude. Yes! We're on him! That one choked it. What do you think? 19? 19? 19 and a half. There's a warming trend going on right now, and all these fish are up shallow. You know, normally I don't like to fish a lot of spawning fish, but these are the conditions you got. Close them out. Pinch the tail right there. All right, 19 three quarters. Okay, here we go. Just pulling up to our bay here, running a subwalk hook. I'll show you how we do it when we start casting. Just trolling up to our point here slowly. Slowly, let's go, let's go. Go, 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 go. The sun hasn't even come up really. So this subwalk, I'm gonna be running it pretty quick. We're gonna get a reaction bite out of these pike. When they're laying down on the ground there, they have one choice, get their meal or pass it up. There, there's one. What do you think? Better, better fish, fish. yep. Yeah. Oh yeah, Sean. Yeah, nice yeah, fish. Yeah, yeah. Let's wait at him. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. Mid thirties right there. Okay. First nice pike. It's gonna go 30, 37 inch pike. Dakota lithium checking in. 37 inch. There he goes. Nice Sean. It's a good uh, good starter fish, yeah. buddy. 37. Some of these bigger sheeps, for whatever reason, they're up in the top two feet of the water column, just cruising up high. And the big ones, are they're like a white color, so you can see them way, way, way easier if you have sun and no wind, but not an option. And we're not coming back here, so we gotta make the most of it. Time management and timing and luck. So, so, so important in this event. It's hard to see, man. So hard. Taro, now that we're here, let's go slow. Look left, look right. Look left, yeah. look right. Oh, there's a shad here. I want the shad. No. I just saw one up high swimming. So much harder to see. We might have to blind cast just this area because, you know? Mm-hmm. We'll start doing it's it. It's a different vibe now, you know? Like 69, it was 72 yesterday and they were all up high. That's why they were up high in the warmth. Oh no. They're not here. Oh no. Maybe we put like small trolling spoons on our Cleos, I don't know. I got a shot! I got a shot! Get the yep. pull. Back it up. Big shot! I'm going Big straight shot. back, turn I'm going around, straight turn back. Around, turn around. It's on the wall, in the mouth. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, easy. Giant shot, giant shot. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Take your time, just take your time, take your time. We need this fish so this. bad. Watch yourself, watch yourself. Giant shot, Get giant off the top shot. there, get off the top. Oh yeah, oh yeah, in the mouth. Oh my, we got a giant yes. shot. No nuclear power plant, we Reunited. Need this. this is key. Oh my gosh. That's the biggest shot I ever got. Oh Maybe. my gosh. How do you hold a oh, gizzard shot? I don't know. I don't know either. <laughs> never caught so one disgusting. like that. But man, yes! that's some big garbage. Yes, <laughs> garbage. Not agree. the fancy stuff. I agree. We gotta chip away at the Let's garbage. Let's measure it. Pinch that tail, tail. 20 oh. inch. No, no. Confirmed, 19 and three quarters. This is the bonus one. Yeah. So key. That's a big point. Chipping away at the garbage is our strategy. That rock bass is gonna be so important for our garbage pile. <laughs> Commence. Tulabi time. 
Aaron and I are double teaming with the Castmaster, a staple deep water jigging lure. One twelve ounce with a small piece of night crawler. 19.75 inch smallmouth bass. That is big. Remember when we had the uh, biggest smallmouth? Yeah. Am I dropping down? Mm. No, not another fish. Slow down, you guys. 19 and three quarter inch gizzard shad. Uh oh. Uh oh. That, that's not good. Get him. Is it a sheep? Is it a giant carp or a sheep? Come on. He's small. Oh. Got him. Sheep! Yeah. Oh yeah, drum roll. <laughs> the old dump and pump, baby. This is a good one. Not as big as no, yesterday's it's not, one. It's, not, it's a start. It's, still, it's, not, it's, a it's start. not. It's too small. But it's key that it bit. Net. Net. All you, buddy. Do it. Do it. Touching 27. Will we take out our number one nemesis, in my opinion, which is Team Kalen's okay. Acme up, buddy. with their own bait. <laughs> <laughs> Drum roll, please. 27 inch cheap. We saw some monsters yesterday. We got a 30. Possible to break 30 in here, I believe, if we get lucky. Come on. Oh, geez. Come on. Oh, geez. Castellano, 27 inch drum. What? Yeah. Holy Team smokes. Tackle Box Lottery is on a tear. Oh. Wow, that really changes a lot, maybe. Yeah. That's the dream period for drum and carp. <laughs> Gizzard Shad, carp, drum, laker. Ugh. It's a dream period. Four points. You ready? Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Drop down, catch the Cisco. It'll cheer us up. We're both chasing a very high suspended mark. We like that. We like that. Yes. Shaking and shaking like a good thing. It's tumbling like a good thing. Ready? Ready? Here he is. Here he is. Here he is. Tumbling like a good thing, Jay. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, what? It's a sucker. We'll take it. Shoot. That was interesting. But a new species. It's over 10 inches. Suck that spoon in. I was actually working a perch higher in the water column, and this sucker came and intercepted it. I mean, 17 and a half inches, new point category. A real beautiful specimen. Let's get back in the water. Oh, I just released our catfish bait. There's some nice high marks there. Oh, oh, oh. Shoot, I'm not paying attention to this high mark. That's awesome. Oh. Pike though. Sure, Skinny. Pike? I think so. Skinny. Ready? Right here he is. Yeah. Little pike coming up. All right. There you go. Thanks, sir. Don't need to measure them. Multi-species. There's a fish coming for someone going. Nice. I think it's a perch. This might be a big perch. Okay, I like it. I like what you do with the place. Yep. Where are you, you going? Go that side? way? This Doesn't side. matter. It's a walleye. Oh, man. We're gonna enter it. So no walleye's entered. Nice walleye for Jay here. We're gonna see if it hits the 10 inch minimum, and it does. We're gonna call it 12 and a quarter. 12 and a quarter inch walleye. Very nice, Jay. Caught this thing yet or what? Yeah, I got him. Not Big it. Yeah. Ben? Take, yeah, take me off that power pole. Hurry up. Drop. Oh. Still got him? Yep. Just grab that net and uh, long net him. Yeah, we got issues. Still on there? Yeah. Oh, we got this. Yes. Give me a little closer. Give me a little closer. Let's try it. Oh, no. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, jeez. Yes. Oh, yes. Shit. Yes. And victory. Oh. Lift up, lift up, lift up. You got I don't think he's 20 inches. No, but. he ain't even that big. Dang it. Won't even help us. Won't even help us. Okay, we need to, we need to move. Let's go fish the main. We need yep. to fish the main river. We can't be donking around with these four pounders that are sitting here up shallow. We need a main river giant. Not a giant. But could be an upgrade. No. no. 34 and a half. Starting to get a bit, bit bigger size. Hopefully we can get a giant here soon. Like how big is this one, Taro? Not big enough. Oh, okay, that's the trick. We gotta make a drop on their nose. I know. The next big one, it's don't a, lead them. It's a bow fin. Yeah, make a drop on their nose. I'm gonna go to that jig. Boom! That was sick. 
Might be bigger. Too bad you, have a, don't might, too bad you don't have a... Uh, might be bigger, Terrell. Look. Really? Yeah, I'm serious. Oh. That nail dude. That's it. Sight look fishing at, was... Look at his eye. He has no eye. Yeah. No wonder you have to drop it's it on one-eyed willy. He's touching there, touching there. 27 and a quarter. Sweet. Upgrade. We got to spend time here. Get myself a new little, new little marabou guy here. A little bit heavier. This is one eighth. Simple marabou jig. And we're literally just looking to the fish, trying to get it close to their face. So you kind of wiggle it, let it drop, move it in front of them. You need to be able to see it. You can blind fish these and just wind them, jig them, wind them. When they, when they hit the sheephead, it's pretty cool. It's a pretty hard thump. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I'm still following me. Let him eat it. Must have been the beef jerky. Mmm. It's really so good. Say about the food in my mouth? Perch. Needs to be 10 inches. 9.75. Buddy. No way. 10 and a half. Upgrade. I got the suspended fish, Jay. I got ten, the suspended ten and a half, fish. Ten and a half. This is suspended fish. I don't know what it is. It's walleye. Oh, Shoot. It's walleye, walleye upgrade. upgrade. Look We're at these upgrades coming in. Hammering fish. 10 and a half perch. Not exactly what we want. 19 and a quarter inch walleye. There's everything in here right now. Jay, 14 feet down over 32 feet. Another point, we might be in first by now. Oof. We gotta head over to crappies. Even after launching, we'll barely have any time. Let's go. Yep. We don't have a, a drum and a carp game plan anymore. Well, that didn't go as planned. We'll just go get a big musky, a big walleye, a big smallie. 19.25 inch walleye. Apple time. I wish it was bacon time. So good bacon. Mm -hmm. Just pretend it's bacon. Oh, it tastes like bacon. This one. Ooh. Oh boy, that's a bigger fish. Uh, uh, that's good. He likes to jump. That's a, that looks like it could be an upgrade shot. Yeah, 36 and a half. Adam's got a little smaller one on. We are gonna have to weed through all these fish. Nice fish though, Sean. Nip when we get upgrade if we need to. We got the everything we need. We're gonna be fishing sturgeon right when we get there. Oh, bait fishing. Bait fishing and Night chilling with energy drinks and food. Coffee and in food a, and in a chips. big boat. Should we gamble with a new species or try to upgrade? Because I saw three upgrades. What do you think Up we're going to get down there? Maybe nothing. I think we can get a bigger one, no? Then we go this way. Don't you think? I do. If we go there, though, we could get nothing or we could get a bunch of bullheads. Everyone's going to get bullheads. Let's just stack a rod for 31 inch here. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to turn a sideways T and yep. we'll go down these rocks. Look at all the big carp here. Maybe get a bigger carp while you're at it. Like there's two here, I can barely see them. Yeah. Wow, Tara, look at the size of that, that one. That's a huge jump. Got him? Yep. Is it big enough? It's pretty big. Oh, is it a 30 though? It's big. Oh, then we gotta go. We gotta net it. Your eyes are good. I can't see it. <laughs> I'm also higher yeah, on yeah, there, yeah, so yeah, it yeah, yeah. you know. The green is helping me. You know what I mean? The green yeah. jig. Oh, it's big. I don't know though. Is it's it gonna be enough? like, it's gonna Pull. be in the same caliber. Or, oh no, it's bigger. These are big sheep, man. This is unreal. It's a big one. Yes. 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 Yeah. Oh, it's big. Yes. It was worth it. We oh got it. Oh my gosh. That's we it. Love you, Polly. Oh Good job. my. I'm not so mad at you anymore. That's okay. I'm sorry I hurt your feelings. Now oh we go bald. Yeah, we're gone. We're gone. We're gone. Oh, 31. Unbelievable. 31. 31. 31. 31. Oh. 31 oh, inch. Oh, they got a big laker, bro. How big? Huge laker. How big? I don't know. It looks huge. Uh, the size of this. That know, is freaking huge. How many inches is the laker? Yep. Clutch. So that's it. So that's our upgrade. Let's go for bullhead. Let's try it. Their laker looks big. They didn't send the measurement. Let's see it. 42 inch. 42 inch. Oh yeah. That's a giant laker, bro. Holy cow. Never mind Eric Hadia. Watch out. Twin hype is on the roll. Dakota lithium. What a mouthful. 42 inch lake trout. No way. There's no way we're beating that. Nope. I'm thinking we need to get into sucker mode. We have been struggling. Sturgeon was nice. Tulabies. Okay. Didn't do well. 
I was just gonna say we found this weed line yesterday and we caught two small ones back to back and saw maybe some other ones marking and left it alone. We wanted to catch them right now. We got uh, not too much time left to fish. I'm using a Kalen's hair jig. It's probably a 16th ounce. Aaron is using a new bait that is being released. It's big. I'm targeting big crappies. The tickle, the tickle tail. Look at all those little appendages on it. That's gonna catch the big ones. I'll probably just weed out the small ones. You can see the cabbage tops there. Is there thick weeds? There's something zooming up. Gone. Pike. Yeah? Yeah. There's hair jigs all over the place. This one's good right here. A fish is coming up at somebody. Oh, here we go. That's a pike. Yeah. What do you got? Could be a crab. Oh. He's up. He's here. He's here. He's here. He's here. He's here. Oh my goodness. Oh. It's a pike. Fish. 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 I think it's a big crappie. Oh, that's big. Yep. Big, yep. Big, yep. Big. Oh, that's a monster. Sure. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Oh man. Look at that tall Slabosaurus. Oh, my heart's racing. Mouth closed, 14. 14? 14 inch crappie. Got one. Aaron's on, going back. Small, don't worry about it, don't worry about it. Are you sure? Yep. Okay. Just dragging it across basically the tops of those weeds. I'm probably only three or four feet down. Beautiful spring crappie. It's silly because we'd probably like to fish for these all day long compared to yeah. a lot of the bottom fishing Casting. and silly fishing we've been doing. Yep. Yep. Not big. What is that? Rock bass? It might be a rock bass. It's a big rock bass. Is it big? That might not be big enough. We might be chasing these later in the week. We need a 10 inch minimum. <laughs> it's a big rock bass. That's one of the biggest rock bass I've ever caught. It but is? Yeah. I'm just saying it for the video, Aaron. <laughs> You didn't even measure it, but you told them it's one of the biggest rock bass you've ever caught. Yeah, I guess. It wasn't 10 inches. No, I assumed it was actually. That wasn't 10 though, right? I don't know, we'll never know. Yo, that drum was sick. See? Unbelievable, so See? clutch. We got all the drama out. This guy's There's so more clutch. drama to come. No, I think the drama was good. I think it pushed you to another level. Last minute stab, we've got like 11 minutes before the first period is over. Uh, looking for a bullhead? Oh, well, whatever works. Twin. One way or the other. It's like Tomax and Zaymont. You just had a bite? Cool. That was that was a good bite. The classic like tut tut and then some movement. You no, know? some weight, not Gobi. No. Not Gobi? No, there was weight. There was weight. Man, we've had a rough morning, honestly. I just I don't feel We haven't caught the big I, fish. We've we, caught fish. We've caught lots right of one. nice smallmouth. But anyways, cut to the chase. We need to abandon the smallmouth. I mean we are leading, but we just don't think that fish is gonna there's no, no. way. We have to be happy with that crappie. Period's pretty much done. That's it. We're done. That's it. One more cast each. Last cast. We could hear our plane running, which is probably John getting it ready. We got gusts up to 50 kilometers an hour. We're gonna make the call here and uh, take off. We worked really hard for a pike, but uh, 37 was all we could do. Yeah. So we're uh, jumping in now and hitting our next spot for uh, the session number two here. Yeah. The evening bite, you'll see where we end up. We are Dakota Lithium, and we are bringing our A-game, boys! It's go time! They got a plane in the background. They got a what? A plane. No way. Yeah. They really have a f***ing plane? Yeah. We're f <laughs> We're, We're so f That was not how we wanted it to go. No. Okay, so I'm guessing they flew somewhere, which we didn't have any rules about flying anywhere. No. So that would make sense why they got the big laker. Funny that we have more points than them, but they, their lake trail point's amazing. Their pike point's pretty good. Yeah. We like our crappy point. We like our sturgeon point, I guess. Sturgeon, sturgeon's tough. You got two hours to catch a fish like that that sometimes you go all day without catching. What's the plan? The plan is we're gonna hit the Niagara River. We're gonna head back home and we're gonna roll the dice with last light for walleye. And there's some smallmouth, but we have big wind on Erie today. So we may not even bother like wasting too much time, but we could get a 21 incher on one of these spots. It's the one we're after. It doesn't count. It doesn't even matter. Jeez. Small, give up. Big bud. Doesn't even matter. <laughs> All right. Come here, open it. Oh yeah. Yeah, there's a fucking 20. On the way back to the dock, Fish doesn't count. We decided to just stop and see. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. 22 inches. 
<laughs> so bad. 22 inch smallmouth, which doesn't count. Should have been here yesterday, Larry. That's crazy you catch a 22 inch smallmouth. You don't even take a picture of them. Oh well, just practicing. AP seems to be a little bit in the dumps, but that's okay. Because I think if we get him a happy meal at McDonald's, it's gonna change everything. Oh man. That was painful. That was painful. We're in last. I like being in last though, because then you know there's nowhere else to go. Nowhere else to go but up. Thirty Nine Hours Season Two is presented by Aquaview and partnered with Travel Manitoba, Acme Kalins, Dakota Lithium, Tacklebox Lottery, Live Target Lures, and Alumacraft Boats.